This screencast will explain some of the advantages of getting my citation set up inside of Google Scholar. Uh, this is the Google homepage, and I'm going to go ahead and click more here and go to Scholar. And I'm going to type in my own name, in, and you'll see what comes up. So Dave Cormier, when you click it in, you'll see at the top here, it has user profiles for Dave Cormier, Dave Cormier, University of Prince Edward Island, verified by. When I go ahead and click on this name here, on my name, this panel comes up here. These are the six articles I've managed to publish in the last couple of years. And these are the citations that Google Scholar has found to go along with them. Uh, it also um, sort of situates some of the work that I do and also gives me a chance to connect to some of the co-authors that I've worked with in the past. So what this does is it allows you to claim your articles inside of Google Scholar, organize them and give people a sense of where your work is, pull it all together, and sort of your own home page from a scholarly perspective. If you sign in to your uh, to Google, if you've got a Google account, then I'll sign in with my own account here. You'll see that it allows you to keep track of your work as well. So when I go to the web home page, it sees like this, but if I go to Google Scholar, in the corner, you'll see it pop up my citations. So it allows me to go in and see what's going on and I can edit these things. I can edit my name, the university I go to, the things that I'm interested in working on. I can verify my email and also um, edit, add some of the suggested co-authors. So these are some other people that I've worked with that I should probably add. And then, uh, so it allows you to really control the way that different people see the scholarly work that you've done. So I advise everybody to go in, if you have a Google account, go in and get your Google Scholar profile set up, organize your work together, and I think that'll give people much better access to the work that you do. Thanks for following along.